In today's video, uh, it's going to be something different and something new. And this is a personal preference on everything that is going to mention in this video. But I'm trying to help here a friend of my alliance to see if we can improve his setup so he can last a little bit longer when base defense and, and doing damage. First thing I will change here is these two guys. Because most of the time, these two guys right here, this one is for base damage, but most of the time, since you only have one RT, you're going to use it for both for base damage and also defense or attacking. So you want to have a balanced officer that can do damage to bases and also to um, troops, troops faster. So you want to change this guy for this guy. And I changed the officer setup in the middle. Now on this uh, unit, you can have, if you want, you can have this. That's fine. I'm going to change the officer setup in a minute. So that's the first change I would do, those two. Now here you have an infantry that is, it's your filler unit. Let's see, you don't have any other officer. Let's see. So you got these three options. This one is awakened, yeah. So this officer, uh, yeah, that's that's fine. Uh, you might want to put uh, probably this officer because that way you can get a little penetration on it. It's not gonna make a difference for this unit, so uh, I will leave it like that. Because what I'm looking for is officers that give you some HP or base damage resist, those type of things. Two filler units. Now on this dude, yeah, you can have those two officers that are pretty good, that's a good setup. Now, something that I saw that I'm gonna uh, get to fix in a minute. So your main two units are gonna be your RT and your helicopter. So when you go set up officers, Let's say your main unit is the RT Without because that's where you're going to get the most uh, damage from it. Victory is my only I'm going to take all of this and off. Do whatever it takes. First, hatred, in the RT, you want to put. Nothing. I'm going to take them there is out no of here. Life for me but the army. Firing data calibrated. Without hatred. So, I would actually, have I'm going to. What I'm going to. Let me put the volume down really quick. Is this now going to affect you? For some reason, it's super loud. So let's just start with the RT. So first, you want to have your increased load, load time of this offer troop, and then in here, my recommendations on what you have, since this unit is gonna be on a kind of filler unit, you won't, you can have, you want to put him on the RT. So when you're gonna go five bases, uh, when you're gonna go five units you change it to this and that way you uh artillery is going to get 40 percent uh firepower or if you're going to go attack bases you change it to this which will increase uh 30 uh, your damage 32 percent when attacking fortifications so you get the benefit of both and then an antonina <coughs> excuse me Actually, let, let's go, let's check all the officers. Let's take everything out from this guy that's been trained. That's fine. 
Let's remove this real quick. That should be all the officers. Yeah, right. So let's see here. So on Antonina, you don't want to use nothing from these two officers because that's your second main unit. Now you don't. I, I'm not gonna use neither uh, this officer, or this officer, um, because I'm gonna use those for your base defense. So let's just start from the bottom. You're not using this guy. So what I will do is either I uh, will use this uh, this uh, two skills again. If you're defendants in an attacking unit, oh, well, you only have that one to two percent. Yeah, you can you can leave that. That way you can blow up bases quicker. Uh, let's see. Now, what you want to look here is that's twenty five percent. This one gives you yeah twenty five percent. So an officer, what I'm looking for is an officer that gives you a bonus on your unit when attacking fortification uh, when garrison in base. Mm, doo, 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 doo. Uh, that's uh, you could if you wanted to change this one for this one that way you have that 30 uh, percent uh, firepower regardless that way this you can you can have it free for later so you can have you can put either this one with it which oh, oops sorry yeah I'll, I'll put this officer and the reason why wait what i'm talking about where is the other officer this is why sometimes ah, right here Increase by 30%. Now, on the second skill, I would. Where is it? What do I want? I want to put a five, a, a max unit, a level five. Why level five? Because that's your main unit. You want to have the most power on it. Now. Now. So what I'm going to put on this guy is going to be a, ba a balance. That way you have more, also more firepower. So essentially your RT now has low time, 40% firepower. You got 30% firepower and 50% essentially having, uh, and that makes your, oops, your RT 54.1 is above. Yes. So buff is 54.1. Now that's done with that unit. Uh, now let's do the your your helicopter, which is your second main unit. You do not want to put the second officer in the first officer because that way you waste a skill and two extra buffed. So in this unit, you most likely are gonna be feel using it. But if, you, if since you're going to have it on the base, you want to be able to do damage while on the base. Now, if you want to kill units faster, you want to put a uh, penetration for this unit. And then you want to look for something that gives you more. Again, it has to be a level. I'm looking for a level five that will. And since you're going to be using this unit later, uh, you can train a skill. And I, yeah, I, I will use that one to give him give him some some fire uh, HP. Now, let's look for another set of skills. Although this one's you, you can only use one, but you're not gonna be attacking fortifications with that. So I will leave that right there, untouch. So essentially. Like again, I'm not gonna use these two officers at all. I don't wanna use those two officers for now. I haven't made my final decision yet on those. Let's see. Yeah. So 
Now let's do, I don't want to do attack fortification. I want to put some firepower. No. So you have those two. Let me see the level of the unit. So that's the, you got those two there. Okay. Let's see. I'm probably going to have to use some of this lady's skills. Uh, so on this one, <coughs> excuse me. So this one gives me 30% HP. So I will put a, I put it a increased firepower and then I will put HP on that. So now your unit is going to be 50.2. That's a biffed up uh, unit. So that's pretty good unit. Now you, that, that puts your two main units on, on two point. Now you want to go to your third unit. For base defense, if you want to do a little bit of base defense, you got these two officers right here. First, on this officer, uh, you want to find if you have a chance, find skills that gives you, since you're not going to be doing damage with it, I'm going to look for skills that provide, for example, this one provides a small 4% uh, base, based uh, reduction. So I'm going to learn that one. Then I'm going to look for another one that gives me the same thing, which is this one. Now that what it does right here is doing is you're getting uh, it reduces the normal attack damage your base take by four percent, and then also you're getting a ten percent damage resist off your base. So well, ten well sorry one percent one percent. If you get a gap, you get a five percent. Uh, you could find that there's a few other units that has it. Uh, that you could change it for that one if it provides you more, but it will be up to up to your preference if you want to do that. Actually, right here, this one. Uh, where is it? No, I thought that, that one gives you some. Oh, no, it's her main main skill. But I'll probably take that one over that one because it's only 1%. This one, I think, is 4. Now, this one is a filler. I wouldn't do nothing with that one. Now, let's look at your third unit. This one, you probably will need it for taking super heavies faster. So, let's see. I will do 50% there. And just to fill it, I would just do a speed for it because that unit is super slightly. Hmm. Yeah, I, I would, I'll probably do that. So right now, that's all your officers and main officers, 555. Five, five. Then your other officers are this one, 555. Five. I would say this one is your third. Sorry. So 55 five, main officer. Five five main officer, five five, five five. Your next one is probably gonna be this one. You're gonna five five on it, since this is just a filler officer, a filler unit. Nah, I won't worry about it. This one you put in officer since it's not having anything, and on this one you have anything. Now what you could put on this one, uh, whatever you want. If you need to, it is not really going to make a difference uh, for that lower unit. Let's see. That's the infantry. Let's 
That's A for now. Not doing that. Not doing that. Not doing that. And just look and see if you have any officer here available that can just give you a little bit more. But you don't. So now if you want to look good that you have more power, probably train one of these skills just to buff that off the, the unit in general. Now you do have an extra officer open. Let's say you're purely base defense. You could change this skill from 30%. I mean, it, it's to 25 more percent on base attacking bases. So this, this officer, now you have it free to put it to any of these two skills that you might want to change that you don't like. If you just say you don't want uh, firepower, but you want attacking more fortifications, you can get 25, but you're going to have this one. So it's 32. So now you have the option of changing that skill to whatever you want. Um, so those are the changes I, I will do. So right now you're fully trained. You're at 224 where before you were at 191. You, well, right now your all time power is 191. Now let's look at the unit. That's fine. The main unit, 22 and 21. Now, since this is your main unit, I would, since you don't have that max yet, I would reset these units completely. And when you reset it, try to max this one and get it done. Uh, put it at this 100% and you don't have to worry about it. And that, that will be an even more powerful RT. Yeah, same thing. Since this is a filler unit, uh, I will reset these two skills and try to get this one max. Now, when you're uh, when you're gonna do base defense, you don't you want to leave this unit in at all time. Never move them. These two units never move them. You if you want to have pull out a unit to reset target, start with this one. Pull the pull the infantry out. Pull it back in. Uh, if that didn't reset target, you could use the ATG because your helicopter is going to take over the power of the ATG more. So just pull that unit out, reset target. But you don't want to pull these two units out at any time. Why? Because this one will give you the shield and also will give you the, uh, the base damage reduction from the two officers that you have there. So... And if you get this to uh, this this level up, you can get up to ten percent at that reduction. So you could get to that additional, but that will be up to you later if you want to do that or not. Now on your research, where's your? You got a lot going in here. That's good. You almost, that's not, yeah. You want to finish this since you, your main unit is an RT. You want to focus on this. And not so much on this side. Because this is going to cost you a lot of, yeah, I will stop advanced city defense. I stop using their, the city coins for this because they're expensive. So I will stop using city coins for that. And I will go for, try to finish this one completely before going to the other ones. And you want to do, you want to do this. You want to finish this two items because that will give you a big, big damage winning base. Yeah, you want to finish all of this. 
like 710 artillery firepower this is important to finish because right now your artillery is strong but is paper is paper strong it's as strong for all those you, those things that you have on it but it's not as strong on research so you will lose with it with it almost to a lower unit i will also uh no no that one sorry if you want i go do this on all of this ones do the five fill it out to five that way you can get reserve a lot faster than than anything so i will go do the first one for all of this ones that way you can get a lot reserve a lot faster than what you're getting it right now so those are my recommendations now what do you know you want to go next and it looks like you're going for a another arty uh, that's what I would do too. Uh, but I would change uh, what I would suggest, in my opinion. Uh, go for a Marty Arty or Rocket Truck. Why? Because if you say you want to go uh, purely base defense or base hunting, you could reset your helicopter, make it a Marty, and instantly a Marty 9.2 rocket truck or arty and then you can switch this officer so this officers to it and you will be doing a lot more damage because you will at that point have two full uh, full artists to do damage so that's what i recommend